Today is Tuesday, October 12th. I think it's 12th, so 2021. We're on the outskirts of Hillsboro, Texas, of course. Some cows out of the fence down yonder. Okay, I'm going to put in the title of this video something to do with General Flynn or Q because I need to I need to put this out there I know that there are other, maybe others that have already put this out there some some big uh, platforms in the what do you call um, alt-right who've been you know booted off of YouTube and whatnot I assume anyway um, I heard something that, that, that confirmed what I've known well, what I saw, what I what I was shown, December thirty first, two thousand nineteen. Okay, I bet it's about Q, Q Anon. It's about General Flynn. You know, the poor general who was done so wrong. Well, he he spoke at some conference recently at Hank Kuhneman. You know, he's a big prophet. Uh, um, you know, he thinks he knows everything. Whatever. Hank Kuhneman's church. And he, the, the talk that he gave, he literally, he literally had the audience repeating satanic or Luciferian type of, 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 of mantra. Of, 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 I can't think of what it's called, but, but basically... Basically, basically, this, he, he was talking, the God he was talking about was Satan, okay? The whole Q movement is Satanic. Kuhneman and all these people, they are deceived by this, by this, by this movement. I had a pretty good idea that, uh, Q was the devil, basically. Um, and probably in the spring of 2018, I think they started 2017 or whatever, whatever. They started in the fall of one year, well then by the spring I was like, eh. because one of the heavy hitters, QAnon heavy hitters, the praying medic, okay, he, um, he, he was on Twitter and, uh, he posted about scripture that that I was like well, that doesn't sound right so uh, what I did was I just uh, made a comment and I asked him to clarify what he was talking about because I thought whatever and, and now I can't even remember exactly what it was okay early on in the Q deal you know the influencers were starting to come out and you know make them you know, have a name for themselves and whatnot so, this guy, he, he blocked me on Twitter for, and, 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 and in response to my comment, I got comments from other Q people, anons, or just followers, I got comments from them, and they were, some were nasty, some tried to answer the question about scripture, but what's his name never responded he just blocked me and you know i i asked you know why would he block me and you know the 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 q supporters well you you know you must have you know done something because blah 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 you know he's a christian blah blah okay well whatever i just i i was curious why would why would he block me it was, that was the second person that ever blocked me the first one was ali ali um, Akbar, Ali Alexander, that guy, yeah, he's, uh, he's always conning people, and I totally called him out on his con, and he blocked me and just trashed me, like, like I was not even a human being, and all I did was ask, and, the, and again, I asked a question to, to clarify, and see what these people, these people who have been getting away with grifting and, and conning people, 
All you have to do is ask them a question that calls them out. They don't like that. They don't like somebody asking that question, you know, or one of those questions that would reveal um, who they are. So, look it up. Right now, on, um, I think the channel is Now You See TV. And they're uh, live streaming uh, this past Saturday night. It's called like Psychopath Nation or something like that. Go to the 15 minute and 52 second mark, mark and watch uh, for it's like 20, 15 or 20 minutes. And listen to what he says. Listen to that, and, and you know this is this is this this particular thing is about General Flynn, and they and they and they that the, 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 he was at this Christian conference, spouting this satanic, freaking mantra crap, and the Christians are there, you know, eating it up. They they adore this man. They idolize this man. Are you serious, Christians? Pull your heads out of the sand because Jesus is coming. This is why we have this crap going on to deceive all of you into this, into this, to, to whatever sort of psychosis you're in. Good God Almighty, for real. Come out of her, my people. Come out of her, my people. General Flynn is a Satanist. He, he said a, a couple of he, he said a couple of things in the past. Just like oh whoa, well you know people with eyes to see and ears to hear, they'll pick up pick right up on this. You know what? It doesn't seem like anybody did. That means that nobody out there has eyes and ears because it's so obvious. The QAnon thing. Stay away from it. It is literally, it's literally. A globalist, elitist game of chess. And what they're trying to do is, they're trying to get the cue, they're trying to get the missing heir to come to the table. And through that movement, they believe that they could make that happen. And there were... There, if, it, if even one of them had any discerning eyes or ears, they would have, they would have already found their cue. But they don't, because they're because it's the devil. And see, the Holy Ghost is, is on a completely different wavelength, completely different channel than the devil. Okay, but the devil, the devil oh man, or Satan. Let's call him Satan because the, you know, devil. You know, is the um, everybody has their their words but look here's the thing all these demons all these just horrible people disguised in sheep's clothing especially General Flynn if any Christian out there can watch that that I'm talking about and come out of it and say that oh well, there was nothing wrong with what he said you are going to burn in hell you hear me? You're going to burn in hell for eternity. If you are not spiritually cognizant enough to discern that. I mean, it's so in your face. Two years ago, when I had my, just right in my face, revelation about QAnon. This was on New Year's Eve, and I had it like, wow. I'll show you one time. Look at the cows. Aren't they nice? I come over here and uh you know I could see it but the Lord you know I had asked the Lord to show me things and he did look how these pregnant cows there's one two three four pregnant ones I see I see how pregnant knocked up and I see some babies some veal over there Hi, I like the I like the color there, taupe color. Come on, come over here and talk to me. They think I'm gonna feed them. Come on, 
I see y'all just cross the road, like the street, like y'all got good sense. I saw y'all cross the street. I was thinking that cows were out. Well, y'all just have free reign of this place out here, don't you? Which is good. It is good. Come on over here and talk to me. Well, come on. In paradise, when we have a thousand years with Jesus, the animals are going to be, it's going to be like, we're all going to be cool. Y'all are going to be fine talking to me. You're just going to come up and say, hey, what's up? You're not going to talk like that, but, you know, you'll come over here. You'll be like, hi. But you're not going to lick on me like a dog. <sighs> anyway, if you're into going to hell, follow Q. Because that's where that's going to lead all those people. You know, and I don't know where they've gone like, as far as social media. I don't know really where they've gone. But when I saw this clip of uh, General Flynn, I thought, wow, i got to get on here and uh, talk about Q. Because, uh, you know, the Lord started, the Lord started, you know, communicating to me about Q a long time ago. And, and uh, you know, when I tried to, to speak out, uh, obviously I don't have a voice. And it was quickly silenced there, but you know, since then they've all been booted off of the Twitter. But uh, <sighs> it's it's, a, it's the devil, and it's a it's a it's a globalist elitist game. And you know what? They're never going to find the Q. They're never going to find the the missing heir, and that's what they're looking for. There's a there's a literal. If you 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 know that song, will the circle be unbroken by and by Lord by and by there's a better home awaiting in the sky Lord in the sky that song okay I can see what that means there's literal oh, wow sir Woo, I got the Holy Ghost Come on, come on, kids. I got the Yeah, yeah, they're coming. Yay. Hi. Y'all are all pregnant, except for the babies. You're all pregnant. Hi. I don't have any food. I could give you chicken, but I don't think I'm supposed to give you chicken. I'm not supposed to give you chicken. Well, go ahead. Go where you're going. Well, go ahead. Y'all just blazing the trail? And y'all were just wondering why I was standing in your way? I'm not going to mess with you. Yeah, those taupe colored ones. Like, that must be mama of the taupe babies. <laughs> y'all are pretty. I bet y'all taste good, too. Yeah, the, the devil's trying to get people to stop eating meat. No, we must not eat beef. You must not eat beef. You're pregnant. You're just a baby cow. Why are you pregnant? You shouldn't be pregnant yet. Should you? You should be as big as her when you're pregnant. Or maybe you're not pregnant. Maybe you just eat a lot. Well, y'all go on. If I had something to give you, I would. I swear. I really would. I would give you something. Give you something. In the sky, Lord, in the sky. And so you know what that song is? I don't know who, who wrote that song, where that song came from, but the Lord showed me that there there are some pieces of music or some some songs that that are um, of the Lord. So too, when the time is right, to open the eyes, the spiritual eyes of people, and that for me. <sighs> Is one of them. Will the circle be unbroken by and by, Lord, by and by? <clears throat> I think it starts. I was standing by my window on a dark and cloudy day when I saw the undertaker. Come and carry my mother away. Said Undertaker, please drive slow. 
something. I can't remember the words. So, look. That song's about making sure that the next generation makes it to heaven. That there are heirs to the throne, literally. There are 12, 12 uh, tribes in, in, the, in the sky. There are 12 uh, 12 uh, tribes, 12, 12 families, 12 covenants, 12, 12 groups of people who um, are heirs to everything, to all, to everything, to all the gold and the silver and everything, because only so much time passes, and and then when time is up, then then what happens is is that is that the is that the powers that be they they come together at the, at the table to see, okay, well, who's got the keys to the kingdom? Who's got the keys? And you know what? I don't think that that any of these people, not even not even one of of, of them. On the on the other side, none of them I, even understand how to get to the keys of the kingdom, or they would have figured it out already because I figured it out. It's really simple. God made everything very simple. Now, now th this is now in, in regard to be, people being saved in salvation and all that kind of stuff. It's really simple. Okay, take your take your burdens to Jesus. Your burdens He'll bear. Okay. When you do that, you have to you have to you have to put lay it put everything at the foot of the cross, leave it with Jesus, and leave it there, and get baptized in the name of Jesus for remission of your sins, and you'll receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Without the Holy Ghost, you're not going to make it through what's coming. We're going to see tribulation. Okay, you know the story of the Exodus when 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 uh, um, the 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 children of Israel were 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 spared from the plagues that that came through onto Egypt. You know, it, there was all sorts of plagues, but you know the worst one was when when the when the angel when the death angel you know came through and 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 killed all the the fir the firstborn of of, of of even the Pharaoh all of them killed their babies. They told me that they were going to kill their babies. They didn't believe them. Well, I enjoyed seeing you cows today. Make me want a hamburger. A big steak. Some veal cutlets. Yummy! So... The global elitists, the ones who've managed to maintain control of all the money, the power, over the the six thousand years, okay, that, that 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 this has been going on. Um, they had lost the Lord a long time ago because everybody everybody starts out whenever there's a, a quote reset, everybody starts out, okay, with something. There's one that has the most, the one who comes to the table, who has the key that unlocks the door, the key that unlocks the kingdom, the key to where the person that can go to, to this, to this meeting of these, 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 these devils and sit down at the table and say, me, I'm the one, I'm the heir, and here's why, and you give them your credentials and show them what, there's no way on God's green earth that it could be anybody else, it's not humanly possible because that's the way God designed it. Okay. There are heirs to the throne, heirs to the fortune, there's heirs to the kingdom. And that's what the whole Q movement, that's what they're looking for. Because he who he who holds all the marbles, you know, controls everything, wins. Right? And now look at look at the look at the where the wealth is. Now, amongst all these heathens, they have, they have, you know, the parties, oh, yeah, good Lord Almighty. So, Q, the, the Q, there's three, you see, there's, there's two places Um, two, 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 two places for 
or two places, two sets of three birth name initials and the letter Q. It's probably going to work out where the missing the, the missing heir, the one the one who did, isn't anything like any of the globalist elites, the the devils, when uh, that 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 person is going to be the one to um, to to get it all because none of them are going to be found worthy to have it. And then this person, the the the, the 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 well, the missing two people. These are two people. Well, actually, no. Wait, there's 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 two there's two people. And two um, charity organizations. Okay, one cultural or of, of the arts foundation. Okay, I know that sounds weird, but it's, a, it's it, it goes back to a person. All this stuff because because you know you wonder how did. How did, how did all this money get into the arts and Hollywood and all that? Well, you know, it's real simple when you can see it. And they, you know, some of the, some of the, some of the folks have been able to keep their money where it was and, and, and some didn't. Most, most were able to keep it amongst their, their devilish, you know, groups and stuff, I guess. That sounds crazy, I know. Stay away from General Flynn. Anything to do with that Q thing, okay? Watch the video. Jesus is coming. Be ready, okay? Spread the word.